<laughs> saving the planet. Yes, absolutely. You're saving the planet by being a degenerate whore. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today we're gonna react again to Vegan Booty. By now, she has 6,666 subscribers. No wonder. Let's have a look. Is not a place okay, this video is called Vegan Paints Herself in Period Blood. Your megaphone and Fantastic. Speaking of Awkward. Yeah, I know this joke has been made before, but if you call yourself a vegan booty, I don't need to say anything. <sighs> okay. I mean, obviously, such activism gets attention, but the question is, of course, what is the message? You run naked into a fur shop and then you're wondering that people want to throw you out again. This has nothing, absolutely zero, to do with veganism. No matter what kind of cause you are fighting, and I have to do this here 10,000 times because it's all a lie anyways, but no matter what the cause, if you would go naked into any establishment, you would get thrown out. What do you expect? <laughs> Just grab her by the hair and throw her out. Read it. This is sexual harassment, obviously, by exposing yourself and therefore force can be used. There is nothing wrong with grabbing her and throwing her out physically. Yes, you are. And aside from that, let me give you a little physique critique, if you will, as a former bodybuilder myself. She calls herself vegan booty. I could make one butt joke after the other if I wanted to, but let's speak facts. If you look at her physique, she trains, she posts body pictures of herself, gym pictures, etc, etc, etc. But you can see that she's incapable of building proper muscle. Her butt is absolutely flat. She's flat chested as well. And I'm not talking about the breast tissue. I'm talking about the muscle underneath. Everything is flabby. Everything is saggy. It is the typical vegan skinny fat look. This comes from under eating protein every single time. Ducks and geese! Louis Vuitton have blood on their hands <laughs> and so do you if you're not vegan! Stop contributing! Man, how that. incapable are you, security guy? Just grab her and throw her out. I understand. I assume you're scared of losing your job if you get too physical with her, but this is your job. Just grab her and throw her out. Just grab her, man. What are you doing, dude? Truth. Incapable. I would just grab her by the thong and drag her out. <laughs> oh, man. It's a mess. By the way, most leather is just a byproduct of the meat industry anyways. Which I know vegans find reprehensive, but it is the most normal thing. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Except Jesus Christ as your Lord today.
And then they wonder if you say they're evangelicals. It's crazy. Yeah, we saw it. We saw the truth. You're mentally ill. <laughs> Did you see the pride in her face? Look at this. <laughs> Okay. Wow. Fantastic. Absolutely careless, of course, if children are watching at all, right? So children that you want to influence, you want to create a new generation that does not eat any meat. You want to create a generation that eats Bill Gates' soy slop. You will convince them by traumatizing them. This is your reasoning behind it. By exposing your naked body covered in period blood. Disgusting evil woman. All right, this video is called Hot Vegans Protest in Lingerie. Let's have a look. Very effective. <laughs> What an idiot. Vegans are crazy. Bitch, you eat body parts. Okay. Wow. This is the West, everybody. Welcome. In Melbourne, hey. Huh? <laughs> Saving the planet. Yes, absolutely. You're saving the planet by being a degenerate whore. This is how you save the planet by going out in public with lingerie, by going out in public in underwear, exposing yourself for everybody to see, children included. Yeah, fantastic. Wow. Look at this. You can see her pubic hair through the thong. And this is obviously a minor. How old will he be? 13, something like that, posing with this half-naked woman. But this is allowed, right? This is what your government allows. They should be sued for sexual harassment right away. And it's so funny to me because in the West, the women, they are so suppressed, right? They cannot do anything. Take a guy with a dick swinging out like this and he's gonna end up in jail. Simple as that. Wow, disgusting. Fantastic, let's watch another one. Yet again, the same mentally ill women. I'm gonna turn off the music. I don't wanna get a copyright strike. Yeah, super original as always. I've never heard that one before. <laughs> Climate change means diet change. <laughs> uh, yeah, free all nipples. Stop stealing milk from baby cows. Eat pussy, not animals. Absolutely degenerate, yet again, right? Be sexually deviant, do what you will, essentially, but do not eat the animals. <laughs> this is all right. You can parade your naked body outside, that is totally fine, but do not eat a steak. This is morality, this is ethics, this is how it works. <laughs> yeah, vegan booty, yes, yes. <laughs> wow. And look at all those tools filming it. Wow. Obviously, super narcissistic has nothing to do with the animals at all. It is all just about themselves, feeling righteous, fueling their pride. Nothing more and nothing less. Wow. Terrible. Look at this. Oh, look into my eyes. I'm a hero. I sacrifice my body for the voiceless. Wow. Veganism, the art of pissing people off by telling the truth. Yes, that's what pisses them off. Yeah, look at this. Even the father, what a cuck. He's patting the kid on the back of his head, <laughs> chuckling while the kid is closing his eyes. Why is your son supposed to see something like this? Is this why you came from China? This is why you came to Melbourne, right? This is what you wanted to expose your family to total, utter degeneracy. Disgusting. Wow. My food is grown, not born. Yeah, sure. Look into the crop industry. Oh man, so oblivious. But it's really the man's fault. Honestly, if you would walk by me like this, I would spit at you. I really mean this. I would spit at you. I would spit in your face. But those people take pictures with you. It's their own fault. A society that has become so proud, so full of themselves, they think this is a good idea. 
naked women in some sort of latex fetish outfit. Yeah, of course it wasn't enough. Free the nipple. All nipples are free. Wow. This is activism. Yes. By exposing yourself. Wow. I'm amazed. Phenomenal. All right, guys, and this is it. Just a quick check-in, so to speak, with a vegan booty. Absolutely nothing changed since her last activism. All she does is, of course, shock value. Yes, this will give you attention, but it will give you attention. It won't give veganism attention. You might believe so. I don't really think you do. Nobody will turn vegan because of this. You are degenerate women outside, naked. People will take pictures of you because they're so brainwashed and demoralized that this is the highlight of the day. Wow, a naked woman. Let's take a picture and upload it on Instagram. It is absolutely laughable. This is what is going on. Nobody will care. Your Louis Vuitton activism, how often do I have to do this today, is of course a utter failure. Nothing more and nothing less. You look like a crazy person. You are a crazy person. People won't go vegan because of this. You're changing absolutely nothing. You're building your social media. That's pretty much it. You're doing activism for yourself. All right, guys, but this is it for today's video. Just a quick one. Let me know if you liked it in the comment section. And if so, leave it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, guys, please do so. And if you want to support this channel, all the links are in the description box for you. Thank you very much for your support. And as always, may God bless you all. Much love and peace. Wow.